The following video covers reading and understanding sensor data within the TEMTRAC system. TEMTRAC can monitor a wide variety of equipment, with each piece of equipment characterized by a color-coded box, green, red, or blue. And each box displays information about how the equipment is currently running and how it is configured within the TEMTRAC system. Within each box, you can read the transmitter name, how this transmitter was named within the TEMTRAC system. Below that could be a description, which is a more defined way of telling you where that particular transmitter or piece of equipment is located. Then the temp or humidity reading telling you what type of probe is attached to this transmitter. The current reading, which displays the most current information that's come into the system about this particular location. The alarm range, which indicates what was configured for this piece of equipment within the system in terms of temperature range. The last recorded date and time that information was sent into the system. The sensor ID number. And finally, there may be an icon in the lower right hand corner which displays any kind of alarm condition currently in the system for that particular piece of equipment. The color coding of each box is extremely important. Green means that all the readings for that particular piece of equipment are within range and not setting any current temperature or humidity alerts. Red means the unit is reading out of range and exceeding the maximum range set, usually meaning it is too warm. A blue box reads out of range and exceeding the minimum range set or too cold. Equipment in an alert state will either be blue, too cold, or red, too warm. A small bell will appear in the lower right hand corner of the colored box. This unit has been out of range longer than the predefined time limit set for the transmitter. It has gone into alert mode and generated a notification to alert. An alarm bell will appear in the lower right hand corner. This unit is currently out of range, but the generated alert has been acknowledged and not cleared. A bell with a check mark will appear in the lower right hand corner. In each case, the bell or checked bell will disappear once the alert has been cleared. The delay factor establishes a time delay where an alarm has not been generated but the unit has exceeded its valid operating range. Once the time delay has been exceeded, an alarm will be generated. There are three alarm conditions that can affect equipment. An exception or temperature range out of valid range, too high, too low, too hot, too cold. Low battery icons will always display in the lower right hand corner of the colored box. Each transmitter could have up to three alarms associated with it at any given time. When one of the icons is clicked, it will open up the corresponding alert page. Information on alerts will be covered in a subsequent video.